Welcome back to Bud Walton Arena. Tonight, the Hogs take on Louisiana Tech. Paul Eels with Jimmy Dykes. I like to hear Shark Sullivan in the starting lineup tonight, primarily because of his defensive play in that ball game against Illinois. Monica for three. And the smack over freshman gets the Meekings double team. Little soft jumper is up and it doesn't look that big. Well, you're looking at a club again that's picked anywhere from second or third in the whack as Davis range one from that perimeter and strong for the hoop. Lost it and now Ferguson three on one. Ferguson's gonna take it all the way and finger rolls it up and in. Arkansas team trying to keep being the first team to ever lose three in a row in Butt Walton Arena. The way they're starting off, I don't think that's gonna happen. Finals. Yeah. So the Miss beat Arkansas. The Actually, Arkansas beat Tennessee. Three won't go for Ferguson. Moves in, makes a steal. Lost it, but battling for it. And will save it. The Sullivan underneath to Monica. And he stuffs it home. That's just staying with it, isn't it? Yeah, er Eric Ferguson ought to get credited. It's just straight motion offense. Ken Heath had set plays early in the season. Sullivan gets his shot to fall. He's laid the groundwork Stan has for what his program's going to stand for over the year. The defense, the rebounding, high offensive rebounder. He's got good strength in that mid middle game. And I just think he needs more shots. He and go field, but he'll get it going. Meeking strong inside. He has six. Seven seconds left on the shot clock. Davis partially blocked. No good. Picked up by Monica. The shot won't go, and Baker will chase it down and keep it alive. Another 35 for the Hawks. Sullivan's little jumper. Good. Sullivan with it. And now he's made all three of them tonight. Loose ball. Baker with it to Ferguson. Gets the lead and will lay it off the fingertips and up and in. Seven now for oh, that trip. Jumper for three is good. Five seconds on the shot clock. Nice drive up the baseline, but again, what made the dressing rooms for the halftime break. But the Hogs up by five, 30 to 25. We'll be back. Johnson brings it back out, reverses it. Baker in the corner to Monica. Long jumper by Pookie is good. Basketball of Louisiana Tech. Davis, nice scoop shot off the left hand. And Davis has fun falling for him. And good feed inside the Satchel. Pretty move by Larry. Probably Engel as a defender. Belton for three, and he's got it. Ten, because when he touches it, I mean, he's a serious threat, and he's a good passer. Yeah. Oh, Davis comes back with a three of his own. When you can be patient, get good good looks. That's a good look by Sullivan right there. Nice. Nice and the jumper, yeah. Aim for Sullivan. You know, Arkansas fans may be a little disappointed about the bowl selection for the Hogs, but you got to think back to the beginning of the year, Paul. This is a team that was picked, you know, fifth or sixth in, their, in the division in the SEC. And if we would have said at the beginning of the year, Arkansas will have a chance to win 10 games this year in football, everybody would have taken it, I oh, think, back yeah. in August. Yeah. I think we got to keep that in mind. Houston and the staff did a great job. Players really concentrated. Wow, what a shot by Sullivan. He's got 10. The guys in blue, their confidence has gone up since this game started. I mean, they came in shell-shocked with a the start they've had. Ferguson's three, got it. Ten for Eric. There's that foul trouble I talked about earlier. Gomez for three. Man, what a big catch. Seven minutes left to play. Well, they're starting to knock down the threes now. Brown with 11. Three players in double figures for Louisiana Tech with 6.50 now left to play. Arkansas was probably a, a defensive stop and a made basket away from putting this thing out of reach. That, that one there might have done it. Kind of 
like a game of horns. Arkansas has enough points to win the game. Now it's just a matter of working the shot clock down, getting high percentage looks, and staying solid on the defensive end. Wow, what a shot by Davis. It's been a pretty simple game plan by both clubs. Arkansas has just had better offense. Davis pulled up on a three and one break. Rebound underneath by Gomez. Clears it away safely. Alley -oop to Monica. And Monica steps it. Great assist by Eric. Monica on the run. Going to take it strong all the way and lays it up and in. Monica with 19. Well, there's the second win in Stan Heath's young coaching career as the head hog. Felton on the other end takes it to the hoop for 16 points. Three players and double figures on each team. Oh, my! What a stuff by Rashard Sullivan. Give him a dozen, and that's going to be it. 72-60, the final score.